Should I just let him go and if he wants to come back, he will? Absolutely. I think you should match the energy he's giving you. Right. So if he decided to walk away and he's going no contact, match that energy. If he reaches out to you once in a while, do the same. Match the energy until it gets to the point where he's being so inconsistent and he's creating unsafety and it's causing, he's stressing and pressing you. At that point, keep it contained. Stop giving him your energy because a man should be about the business of creating safety for you. And if he's not creating safety for you, then you need to withdraw. And yes, let him figure out his shit and come back when he's ready. Well, I'm gonna tell you, a man is purpose driven. So a man needs to chase. A man doesn't, doesn't need a woman to chase him. He needs to do the chasing because he needs to feel purposeful within that relationship. Mm. So if you're always like trying to get his attention, you're texting, you're calling, and he's non-responsive to it, and he's being nonchalant, then he's going to walk away from that relationship. And the reason he's walking away is because he's not purposeful or doesn't feel purposeful within that relationship because you're doing all the work. You're now in your masculine and not in your feminine. Mm -hmm. And so now you're matching him and now he's competing with you like for the alpha position. Mm. And, and, a, and a man that's competing alpha for alpha, even if it's against a woman, is going to want to win or walk away from the situation. 